Hey guys, and welcome to the free Unity assets for April, May 2021. And this month features over 70 fantastic great assets across the board, whether that's scripting assets, models, textures, shaders, really useful things to get you started with game templates and so, so much more. And I just wanted to mention before we get started is I'm going to be adding so much more content and exclusive content to my Patreon, which will allow you to download all the free scripts that I feature in my videos, all the projects with all the project files, any bonus content, where it'll give you access to bonus content that you won't be able to find anywhere else. And I will be going back to all my previous tutorials, which had scripts and things, and I'll be adding them there for you to be able to download if you become a supporter today. So be sure to check that out and I'll leave the links in the description. So number one is the URP Dissolve, and this is a URP basic dissolve shader using the shader graph, which allows you to have specific features for noise dissolving, directional dissolving, easy to use and replace. You can add extensions through different subgraphs, and it specifically allows you to customize a dissolve style effect with different colors, effects, and more. The next one is something called Super Editor, and it's a versatile Unity Editor extension that adds powerful built-in ID hierarchy and favorite enhancements to actual Unity itself. So it allows you to have a built-in IDE to look at different elements of code. So you don't need to actually switch to Visual Studio or Visual Studio Code or any other um, different IDE program to be able to get the features. It'll have hierarchy improvements to have left clicking and right clicking game objects to be able to quickly see the different scripts and things on the objects and enhancements to set favorites frequently used and loads of things like that. The next one is the Pointo RTS Blueprints and this is a really basic starter kit for a real time strategy game whether you want specific things to be able to uh, select move and do things with specific units. It's based on scriptable objects which you can extend it has and it allows you to add lots more complexity to it but it's a really a basic getting started for RTS style mechanics. The next one is the simple free stylized nature kit and it's a bunch of assets which include trees, rocks, bushes in a low poly pretty much stylized way between 80 and 7000 triangles with eight different meshes, a demo scene and everything ready to go from there. The next one is the furniture pack free and this is a collection of 20 free game ready models for hotels, tables, closets, sofas and loads of other things. So 20 different meshes, prefab, 70 materials up to 2k resolution. The next one is the Unity's visual scripting tutorial and this will be and this allows you to follow a specific game template called Clive's Cat. It lets you look at visual scripting to help solve puzzles and different things within a visual scripting tool set. The next one is the Easy Volume Renderer, and this allows you to use sort of 3D volumetric data sets, and it could let you use look at specific cross sections of um, medical scans, or maybe just some fancy gameplay mechanic that you might want in your game, which has got a sci-fi theme to it. The next one is a few things by this developer, and they've got a whole bunch of stylized materials, and this is the stylized pixel rock and it's all PBR related materials in a stylized way, so be sure to check all these out. This is the Swordsman Skills Free Icon Pixel Art, and this developer has another set of another set of pixel art, and this contains a set of 48 different specific pixel art for a swordsman or a small little RPG style. The next one is the basic graphics settings menu, and this is a package which includes things for resolution, screen mode, and the actual quality and it allows for all different render pipelines and you can save the graphic settings into an XML file and it can be edited externally. The next one is the Undead Skeleton Enemies and this is a selection of undead enemy skeleton based characters with eight different weapons, two different sets of characters which all share the same materials featuring between 100 and 400 different triangles. The next asset is the free Vikings pack and I think this is a really nice stylized kind of sweet pack which is a bunch of small assortment of objects for a house, a tree, a boat, a person and some weaponry. The next one is the lock and key model pack and as it suggests it's a bunch of PBR related with four different colors at 4000 resolution and each with one material 
suitable for all different render pipelines. The next one is the free selection outline and it's a handy and powerful three style outline which is available to outline the whole object, colorize the occluded object or outline only the visible object and it allows you to add the script onto the object and it allows you to set the different parameters for the different styles of outline that you want to use. And last but not least is the playground low poly of low poly playground models with 47 different models with 47 textures with a demo scene with different high quality light mapping UVs with texture sizes from 32 to 512 with triangle counts between 18 and 1700 triangles. So there is far more assets for this month. I'll leave all the links in the description for you to check out and be sure to come and join me on Discord. Check out my great assets on the Unity store and come and check out my Patreon if you want to get access to free scripts, free projects and so much more as I continue to add those. So thanks very much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Cheers.